Welcome to Europe Up Close. Trekking Europe has become our favorite pastime. Each year, we're on a mission to hike more and write about all our favorite trails. For the purpose of this post, we've compiled all our favorite treks in Europe. These treks are multi-day hikes, ranging from three to 10 days. Most of these European treks are hut to hut, which means you'll overnight in mountain huts along the way. Today, we will tell you about the best mountain hikes in Europe. Number eight, Jungfrau, Switzerland. Switzerland historically is one of the greatest hiking countries in Europe and has been a favorite of the British for many, many years. Jungfrau takes the spot as one of our best places to hike in Europe not just because it's in Switzerland, but because it epitomizes alpine freedom and natural mountain beauty. The variety of routes to traverse allows you to take on hikes with a range of difficulties, distances, and durations. One of the prime attractions takes you close to the Jungfrau Jo, an impressive 3,466 meters above sea level. With the many hiking trails, come ticket options, allowing you the freedom to explore the mountains using an excellent rail system to transport you around to different trails. If you want to maximize your time here, then the Jungfrau Hiking and Sledging Pass is recommended. It can be valid for two to seven days and provides access across much of the area. For places to stay, there are options for cozy mountain huts, hostels, and even some camping options. There is an extensive list of options, as well as general information that can be found on the Jungfrau website. We can't talk about this spot for hiking in Europe without mentioning the fact that this is a part of the real-world inspiration for J.R.R. Tolkien's Middle Earth. Number 7. Alta Via II, Italy Italy, home of the Romans who walked everywhere, has some of the best trekking trails in Europe. The Dolomites alone have incredible hiking trails scattered across their dramatic peaks. This is where the Alta Via II comes in and is one of the top hikes in Europe. Some say even the world. Known to be more challenging than Alta Via I, this is one of the foremost multi-day hikes in Europe, lasting around eight to nine days and covering over 160 kilometers. You will cross a multitude of terrains, experiencing natural parks, the Sella Massive, and traditional, authentic Italian villages, each with their own charm. There are countless guides available to lead treks throughout the region. Alternatively, you can take on the hike solo, but make sure you have a decent guidebook, map, and knowledge of trekking remote areas. No permits are necessary for this route. The usual stops along the way include the Refugi Mountain Huts, which are among the finest in Europe. On this useful planning guide for Alta Via 2, you can find relevant information for huts and hotels. Number 6. Norwegian Fjords, Norway You can't talk about walking holidays in Europe without mentioning Norway. The Norwegian Fjords are not to be missed. Their natural beauty and glacier-formed inlets with the surrounding land create some of Europe's best treks. The fjords are a hiker's paradise. There are many varied routes and some of the best walks in Europe. Notable recommendations are Skola, an impressive mountain with panoramic views, and Trolltuna, a sturdy rock formation that juts out to provide some adrenaline-inducing views. All of the fjord routes will satisfy your hiking needs no matter what difficulty you're looking for. An aspect that makes the fjords one of the best hikes in Europe is the right to roam. Alamen Saretan, the traditional right in Norway means you are free to explore the countryside and set up camp for the night freely. Perfect for lovers of the outdoors way of life in search of a real connection with nature. There are, of course, extensive accommodation options that include hotels and cabins if camping isn't for you. Learn more about the right to roam and discover the range of accommodations available on your trip. This right to roam also means you won't be needing any particular permits. Hiking without guides is relatively easy, making the fjords a great choice for beginners and those wanting easily accessible treks. Number five, Retezat Mountains, Romania. 
A lesser-known destination for hiking in Europe, the Retezat National Park and mountains are an interesting trekking proposition, a hidden gem that is changing due to increased popularity. This is a special place that has won the hearts of many trekking enthusiasts looking for something new. Home to 20 peaks, with the highest standing at 2,509 meters, Romania has a flavor all of its own. This is especially so with Polagia, the highest peak in the region and one of the most popular walks in the area. You will be rewarded with stunning views spanning this mountainous area. The rolling landscapes below and gorgeous glacial lakes, as well as protected UNESCO wildlife area. This is a nature lover's heaven. Keep your eyes open and you will see lynx, bears, and an amazing array of birds and lesser creatures. You will not need a permit for hiking in the Redizat area. However, you will need to pay a small fee of around two and a half pounds to enter the national park. The ideal places to stay are the mountain huts. Number four. El Caminito del Rey, Spain. Set in Gaitanes Gorge in El Choro Maglia, placed an impressive 105 meters above the river, below is El Caminito del Rey. Taking on this special hike will give you spectacular views and an adrenaline rush like no other. El Caminito del Rey, the king's little pathway, stands out as one of the best walks in Europe and is quite different from the others on our list. This is a notorious walk and is known as the world's most dangerous pathway. Certainly not for the faint-hearted. Instead of being a long and arduous hike, the an eight-kilometer route of excitement and wonder through the Spanish landscape. It's easily accessible from the nearby town, but you will need to book in advance to secure your place on the walk. Booking will cost you 10 euros or 11.55 euros if you want the return bus included. This is recommended because the hike is only one way and traversing the route once will be more than enough. This is a comparatively short hike. It can easily be integrated into other holiday plans you have whilst in Spain, like cycling or sport climbing. Make sure to plan ahead because this is one of the best hikes in Europe and it's popular. Number three, Mount Triglau, Slovenia. Easily accessible from the capital city of Ljubljana, Mount Triglau is one of our top mountain hikes in Europe. The awe-inspiring summit of 2,864 meters is worthy of any enthusiastic trekker's time. As with much of the trekking in Europe, the routes here are part of a national park. Perhaps one for the bucket list of the leading places to hike in Europe before you hang up your boots. There is something for every level of hiker here, from the short and sweet to full-on multi-day hikes that show the vastness of Triglau and the Julian Alps. Unfortunately, you won't be able to pitch a tent and camp along the way. This is the only drawback for DIY trekkers. There are the usual mountain huts for longer hikes and hotels nearby if you plan day trips to the national park alongside other activities. Number two, Luvaville, Iceland. Away from mainland Europe is Iceland. The prime time for hikers to travel to Iceland is between July and September. During this time, you can experience some of the best walks in Europe. Luvaviv stands out as the premier hiking route, attracting walkers from all over the world. Translated literally as the hot spring route, this glorious hike takes you across the Icelandic landscape on a well-marked trail. Traveling the 55-kilometer route should take around two to five days, depending on how seasoned you are or how much time you want to take in the sights. During this trek, you will see many extraordinary and colorful sights that make up the Icelandic highlands, the glaciers, hot springs, and otherworldly rock formations. You even get the chance to bathe in one of the hot springs. Making this a top walk in Europe for anyone interested in the geothermal beauty of Iceland. It's safe to say that Luvaviv is a well thought out route, and this is reinforced by the accommodation along the way. There are plenty of carefully positioned huts to spend the night. These will need to be booked in advance and you will need to bring your own sleeping bag and essentials. The cost is around 8,000 to 9,000 kroner per night, which equates to about 55 pounds. Alternatively, there is camping available around the huts. Pitching a tent will be cheaper at 2,000 kroner or 12 pounds. 
Wild camping isn't allowed on this route. Number 1. High Tatry, Slovakia Across the 25 peaks of the High Tatras, you will experience some of the best hiking in Europe. This mountain range resides in the national park High Tatry and is partially shared with Poland. It is well respected both nationally and internationally as a unique hiker's heaven. There are numerous routes with varying lengths and attractions. Popular routes include Peak Koprowski, 21 kilometers, approximately eight hours, the Loop Hike, Mojnikska, and Frokotska Valleys, 15.9 kilometers, approximately six and a half hours. But there is plenty more to discover. For accommodations, there is a good choice of hotels, guest houses, cabins, and cottages found in the surrounding villages and towns. Where do you want to travel next? Thanks for watching.